Gainesville Police and Meridian Healthcare have joined forces to try a tag team approach in the field. WUFT's Sky LeBron explains the co-responder program. Are announcing a new co-responder program. Mental health related calls have been tough for law enforcement to deal with. Situations like the 2016 Robert Dentman shooting, where 16 year old Dentman was shot and killed by police while holding a replica gun, is just one example. It's hard to measure the data um, of the underlying cause of mental health in all the police calls we go to. But my understanding is that folks, the population in the jail who needs mental health services has increased. The co-responder program will pair one Gainesville police officer with a Meridian behavioral health care clinician to respond to 911 calls related to mental health. From there, the unit can conduct follow-ups. So the co-responders can do it, the clinician can definitely do it on the co-responder team. And then we have a full forensic team here at Meridian that can actually do the handoffs. Although they've been on the road for just one day, the officer and clinician have already had their hands full. <laughs> With time, GPD hopes it can expand the $300,000 pilot program. Being a police officer with Gainesville for 25 years, there's no doubt in my mind that we have the, the amount of calls that could support an additional team or two or three or four teams. So Sky LeBron, WUFT News.